Good morning, great team and welcome to Mabarai School. How are you? Everything is okay with you. Our lesson today is vocabulary and speaking will you for. The school vision is to prepare creative, well educated students who are able to establish civilized, aware reserved society, stick to the authentic morals and values, in addition to using the modern technology. Our value for this week is depending on a law. Starter for this lesson, say words that begin with the following letters J, O, B, and S. You can pause the video to present your own answers. Now, let's identify our first objective to identify new vocabulary by matching the adjectives with definitions using dictionary. Open page number 50. First, give meaning of the new words using the picture. Number one, sociable. Sociable. Number two, imaginative. Imaginative. Three, rational. Rational. Four, courageous, courageous, and finally, honest, honest. Sociable means to meet with other people, imaginative to think of new ideas, rational, not based on emotions. Courageous means brave, spontaneous, without planning. Honest, tell the truth. Reliable means trusted or trustworthy. Anxious means want to be successful. Disorganized, not arranged or not organized. Patient, be calm. So let's move page number 50. Match the words with their meanings or their definitions. Pause the video and present your own answers, then compare them with me. Have you finished? Okay, let's check. Number one Mark is such a sociable young man, he can easily start a conversation with a complete stranger. F. Enjoying meeting and talking with other people means also outgoing. 2. You need to be imaginative to create something unique. It means E. To get a thinking of new and interesting ideas. 3. Frank is a very original person. He never lets his feelings affect his, his decisions. B. To be able to think calmly and make decisions that are not based on emotions only. 4. Andrew was very courageous. He ran into the burning house to save the girl. It means G. Brave, showing courage. 5. Olivia is the most spontaneous person I know. She doesn't think twice about anything. It means H. Jane thinks without planning them first. 6. Karen is a very honest young lady. You should believe her. It means C. Always telling the truth. 8. Harry is an ambitious young man who will do anything to achieve what he wants, but before this, Let's read number seven. Whenever I am in trouble, I go to my sister. She is the most reliable person I know. Number seven means I can be trusted when, in, when needed for help or support. Eight, Harry is an anxious young man who will do anything to achieve what he wants. A, which means really wanting to become successful. 
Nine. Liv is too disorganized to become a successful accountant. It means J. Bad at arranging or planning things. Ten. Our teacher is patient. She never gets angry with us. Patient means D, which means able to stay calm for a long time. Okay, so, as is your so. Put the following words in meaningful sentences. Honest, sociable. Pause the video and present your own answers. Now, test yourself. Ahmad loves to meet with other people. That means he is sociable, excellent. Our teacher is, she never gets angry with us. He is always calm. Excellent, patient. And let's move to the second object of today to talk about the advantages and disadvantages of specific jobs using the phrases in the boxes and pictures. Page number 50. First, what can you see in each picture? What characteristics, what characteristics do you need for the jobs in the pictures above? In the first picture, it's about a a teacher, excellent. What about number two? Firefighter. What about the third one? A lawyer, excellent. Teacher needs to be calm and patient with students. The firefighter needs to be brave and courageous. And the lawyer or the judge needs to be always honest. What are the advantages and disadvantages of each of these jobs? Think about it. Would you like to do any of these jobs in the future? Why or why not? You can use these phrases or these expressions from the box. To be hardworking, to be a role model, have good communication skills, like helping other people, deal with emergencies, Provide medical care. Work well as part of a team. To be organized. To become a what? If you want to become what? People who want to become what? In my opinion, you have to be able to do what? I think or I believe you must have the ability to. That you definitely need to. This job involves being blah blah. Okay? So you can say the advantage of this uh, disadvantage of each job of books. Now stop and think. What's your favorite job and why? Now it's time to close our lesson, read and answer the questions. Ahmad was very he ran into the burning house to save the girl. So Ahmad was very courageous. Our teacher is patient. She never gets angry with us. So we have finished our lesson today, till we meet again next lesson, see you soon inshallah.